This is what I have to deal with. Oh, you guys can't even see now, but watch. That, that's not what I was talking about. This is what I was talking about. This little nose, it's in my shot. I just wanted to make a video about something that I've actually already written a blog post about but I wanted to record it in this form of media. I just wanted to point out why I am vlogging and blogging. There is a part of me that wants to share stuff with the world um, but I do also know that I make it hard for people that actually want to follow me to follow me. A lot of popular pages or just pages in general have a theme to their everything. If you look on pretty much any social media, Instagram, YouTube, websites such as blogging, um, there's almost always a theme to the content on a single person's page. Gen like you would follow someone because you liked their makeup tutorials and they're always posting stuff about their makeup products and beauty essentials. Why did I pick a topic I have no nothing about. Um, like you'd follow that person because you're interested in that topic and like the way they do that topic. But for me it's really difficult because I have such a broad range of things I'm interested in and I sort of chuck them all together in one big go and there's no theme to anything I do whatsoever. Legit everything is all chucked in together on my one page, my one account. So my Instagram is literally everything, whereas on, for example, YouTube, you probably can't tell because I don't have that many videos yet, but I am categorizing them um, as much as I can. I try and add tags so that they're findable, but they are categorized and I, once I have quite a few more videos, I will start making playlists so that you can sort of go through what you're actually interested in and just watch the stuff you're interested in rather than everything. So yeah, what I'm basically saying is that my content has not got a theme, it doesn't follow anything, it is literally just completely everything that matters to me. Every little bit is the title of my blog, my channel, um, all the really important things that mean a lot to me. Uh, it's actually some, from a saying that I wrote um, in a book I was writing. It's basically a, a portion of a quote from a character I wrote. Um, where she basically said everything that happened in life parts of it made me happy and parts of it made me sad and every little bit made me who I was and who I will always be. That saying actually means a lot to me. I remember it all the time and remind myself that every little hard thing I go through in life and every little happy thing I go through in life all of it is needed to make my life my life and everything shapes me in some way or another and I can't go through those happy bits without experiencing the sad bits and stuff like that. Um, it, it means a lot to me. So that's why my blog post is based on, is called Every Little Bit and why this YouTube is called Every Little Bit and it's also why every little bit of my life that I want to share is in my blog, my YouTube, my Instagram, everything. I'm not going to pick a theme and stick to it. I'm starting out with no theme whatsoever because that's how I, that's how it is. That's how I want it to be. That's how I am. Saying that, the purpose of this video is to explain to everyone why I blog and why I vlog. If you are what, <laughs> the door is open. Oh no, the door just got opened by Millie. Hop out, Mills. What was I saying? The dog opened the door and now I'm confused. But yeah, I don't expect a lot of people to watch my videos. But if you are watching it, I hope you learn stuff from my videos. I hope you get some inspiration or some understanding of something you didn't know before. I do want to start doing some tutorial videos on things I know a lot about. Um, Obviously at the moment I'm going through a lot of pregnancy things, so educating people about pregnancy is currently what's happening just because I'm learning everything about pregnancy as I go along. 
so I do want to teach people. I want people to be inspired by my content and learn from my content and that is that is something I want and that is a reason why I'm making my content public. But another huge reason that I'm recording everything, not just stuff that other people would be interested in, is because of me. I am breathless. Um, but I want to have this stuff uploaded so my future son who's in here, not that I can lift my belly up any higher, um, can literally go on YouTube and see his life growing up, see what mattered to me, his mother, and also like see himself in years to come. Um, it's like writing a diary except when you write a diary it's just for yourself. This way I'm sort of writing something for me that my entire family can go back and re-watch, my friends can understand parts of me my future son will be able to understand parts of my life and then hopefully I'll also be able to educate you guys and educate other people through some of my videos at least. I have so many reasons to record that every little bit of my life I want to put in here. That's a bit unrealistic, obviously I have to actually live the life. Um, I'm just going to finish because I'm really rambling now but I just wanted to put this video out there so that people knew not to expect a theme at all and to literally expect anything from me and also so that my future self can look back and be like okay she wasn't just a complete crazy person uploading everything she actually had thoughts and knew why she was doing this but yeah I hope you enjoyed this video even though it wasn't really an enjoyable video maybe it was I don't know um, but if you did like it then hit the like button give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! If you enjoyed watching, please give this video a like. And if you'd like to see more videos in the future, hit subscribe. Thank you!